at our building on 61 Whitehall for the topping out ceremony. This means we're halfway through the refurbishment of our building. We plan to be back in the building physically in one year's time in the spring of 2023. And we look forward to welcoming all of you to future events where we will discuss the critical issues, defense, security, and geopolitics. I'm incredibly grateful for Coniston for doing such an incredible job in making sure that the building is fit for purpose and ready to take Rusi into the next century. Well, I'm standing here at the top of Bruce's iconic landmark building in the middle of London. We're at the heart of UK government and defence. There's a Ministry of Defence on one side of the building. Downing Street, just over my shoulder. Horse guards behind me. And this building has stood for 125 years. Rusi itself is nearly 200 years old. And what we are doing is refurbishing this building thoroughly for the first time so that it enables our critical work as one of the world's top think tanks on foreign policy, on defence, on security issues to carry forward for the next century and beyond. It costs a lot of money. We've raised already £10 million towards this and thanks from me to all of the donors and supporters who've made that possible. We need now another £3.5 million pounds. That's to make sure that we kick this building out with the best possible systems so that we can, as we must, not just reach but involve international audiences and participants in Rusi's life and in Rusi's events. Everybody at Rusi is longing for the day to come, the first half of 2023, where we will be back here in our home at the very heart of public life in London and we will be as active and forward-looking as ever in championing new thinking, critical thought, fresh ideas on defence and security policy.